I try not to read billboards, and yet they're everywhere. In the movies, on the streets, on my mind, in my dreams. Yeah, I know, I sound insane when I say I dream about billboards. And yet there's one billboard I can't quite avoid, and that billboard is me, and that billboard is me. Who I am, what I am, every flaw is every faux pas behind some sort of pointless law firm advertisement. And I will fight for you, but I can't even fight for myself. I'm on display, and I judge. This billboard is my curse. Sometimes I try to escape into my mind, whether it's a dream or a thought, but just for a moment. No stress, no mental complication, just a vacation down memory road. I'm driving, cruising, when the brake lights up ahead draw my attention away, my attention at bay, astray in the sea, and able to see the thousand cars, thoughts, cars, back up, back up the hill and back up my mind, defined only by emotion, which is clutter and rust, grinding gears that fit at one time, a door that doesn't quite close anymore. And I look up and I see my billboard. You see, sometimes I'd like to think that my thoughts are creative, progressive, and yet when my mother, fed up with my cocky annex and my know-it-all attitude, told me to go home and look up the word humble in the dictionary, my psyche sneaks from behind my eyes and into my heart and sees me for the flaws that I am, tears in my eyes and a stick in my hand, jabbing my stomach every night before I go to sleep, and I can't sleep. The day plays over and over in my head. My mind is an old VHS, and I keep hitting rewind and play. Why? Why did you do that? Why did you say that, rewind and play? How could you be so stupid? Do you see what you did right there? You were very foolish. You deserve loneliness, not friends, not praise. Rewind and play. I can't sleep. The ceiling has become my eyelids, and it falls in on me every night. My math homework leads me a bedtime algorithm. <laughs> can't sleep, think, sleep, but I can't. Cause I'm looking up at the billboard, soaring down to the film more. The lesson isn't to kill more, but to listen to your mind and feel more, heal more. The cure to my distaste will outlast the waste because let's face it, if you draw your time in a line back, or find what crime took place and replaced you, shaped you, made you into new human life, you find only the mistakes and the flaws and the times you tripped on the curb in front of the girl you're after, and how she laughed and walked away, and how your friends found you and helped you back on your feet, and you had the best day of your life. Who cares? Who cares about every wrinkle and tear? Eyes aren't made to judge. They only observe and they repair. Why should I care? Now I just stand in front of it. <laughs>